the JCVI published its advice in the last hour. First, it advised that the minimum dose interval for booster jabs should be halved from six months to three months. Second, that the booster program should be expanded to include all remaining adults aged 18 and above. Third, that these boosters should be offered by age group in a descending order to protect those who are most vulnerable to the virus. So priority will be given to older adults and people over 16 who are at risk. Fourth, that severely immunosuppressed people aged 16 or above who have received three primary doses should now also be offered a booster dose. Finally, that children aged between 12 and 15 should be given a second dose 12 weeks from the first dose. I can update the House that there have now been five confirmed cases in England and also six confirmed cases in Scotland, and we expect cases to rise over the coming days. And so the uncertainties are transmissibility, severity of disease, where there is no definitive signal at this point from South Africa. But we should all note that even without increased severity, as the case numbers grow, then hospitalizations will also grow. And finally, on the effects of the new variant and how well vaccine effectiveness will hold up, here I want to be clear that this is not all doom and gloom at this stage, and I do not want people to panic at this stage. If vaccine effectiveness is reduced, as seems pretty likely to some extent, the biggest effects are likely to be in preventing infections, and hopefully there will be smaller effects on preventing severe disease. And we are at that moment with Omicron, it is the new kid, new kid on the block for now. And I think it's true to say that scientists around the world, not just in the UK, unfortunately agree that this one is of increased concern. But in acknowledging that concern, I want to be very clear and I want to emphasize the very high degree of current uncertainty in our knowledge. There are far more things we don't know yet than things we do know. Now that is going to change very rapidly as scientists around the world mobilize on this over, I predict, the next three weeks. 